Send her back. She did. She was twerking for votes, bro. Come on, bro. Um, and none of them have to do with the policy. This has been a very targeted um, attack. On policy of what? You shaking ass? What is the policy? What does anything have to do with the policy? Policy of what? You want to go shake your ass and you get backlash. No, all you have to do with policy and laws and blah, blah, blah. You made it not about that by posting that video. You decided to post that. Did nobody else post that for you? Did nobody else put a gun in your head and say, you better twerk and you better post that shit? Get fuck out of here. What? I struggle with the idea that in order to be respected, I have to be fully clothed and buttoned up. And I have to be performing. In a You're way. a fucking senator. You're a fucking senator. Not a stripper. Not a bathing suit model. Not an Instagram model. You're a fucking senator. What the fuck are you talking about? Being respected, fully clothed. There is... A certain if you're gonna do specific jobs, you have to be you have to dress a certain way or you have to be a certain way. If you don't wanna be that certain way or act that certain way, don't fucking do the fucking job. What's popping YouTube? We back with some more reaction videos you did today. We reacted to this, uh, what's the, what's this bitch name? We reacted to the senior, senior. We reacted to the Senator Tierra Mack. Uh, I don't know if y'all know, she was, uh, she is U.S. citizen senator. Uh, I don't know what, it, what state she's for, but she was twerking. And, you know, she tried to explain, I guess she's trying to explain why she was twerking or whatever. But hey, we ain't gonna waste no more time. We're gonna get right to this video. Hit that like button, comment, subscribe. Uh, hit the notification bells. All right, we're gonna get right to it. Uh, my current opponent is someone who's also uh, arrested for misappropriating campaign funds. Yet I, on my day off, um, am shaking my body um, in a joyful and have a smile on my face. And that is what uh, the conversation is centered around. It's a dangerous double standard. And a lot of the, the content that I create is meant to highlight the ways in which I am treated differently. It wasn't until this national coverage that folks in my community, that um, many people in my community were talking about the policies that I have lived. Uh, this came on the heels of the overturning of Roe v. Wade, which uh, would take away the right to abortion for so many people in our country. And yes, the conversation is around my body, not around my safety, not around my rights, not around my autonomy. What? Man, you don't get the fuck out of here. What is what does twerking have to do with your body safety? Like, come on now. It's we have to have some uh decorum with our people in the Congress. You know what I'm saying? I guarantee she one of those people that yeah, when Trump was in office to all the bullshit he was doing. Now you gonna do some bullshit? Hey, two wrongs don't make it right. So, motherfucker, you can't be just twerking and be a US senator. Like that's no, that's not no. It's about my body not being able to be controlled by a group of people or a group of norms that say I have to be skinny, I have to be modest, I have to be XYZ in order to be a Oh my gosh, the mental gymnastics. She just keeps talking about being controlled. What is it? twerking have to do with being controlled? You decided to go off and twerk and be a US senator. You decided to do that. Like what? Like what are we doing here? Come on, brother. You're not even making no sense. Be a leader. In reality, I'm a part-time state senator. I have a full-time other job. Oh, she's I'm part-time now. Vacation. I'm allowed to lead a joyful life. I'm allowed to live a full life, and I'm allowed to share that there is there is joy, there is dancing, and there is there's twerking, there are bathing suits, there are days off when you are a young elected official. Who but what's she twerking for votes? Being compassion. And then also balances that with um, showing folks what is, and inviting Wasn't she twerking for votes though? Like, hold on, let's 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 find out. Let's see if we can find another video because I think she was twerking for votes. Can someone please tell me what's going on? 
Oh, she a Karen. <laughs> I mean, he a Karen. I'm talking about she. Senator, you're a fucking senator, not a stripper, not a bathing suit model, not an Instagram model. You're a fucking senator. What the fuck are you talking about? Being respected, fully clothed. There is a certain if you're gonna do specific jobs, you have to be, you have to dress a certain way, or you have to be a certain way. If you don't want to be that certain way or act that certain way, don't fucking do the fucking job. Because when you twerk as a senator half naked, you're gonna get backlash. Like anybody with a fucking brain would fucking know that. That is inauthentic to myself. I have to be performing in a way that society has determined is professional. And That's so unper- we're being challenged in her primary this September by former state rep Joel Mita, and there's also a Adriana uh, Bonilla who's running for the seat. Man, I, I hate people that want to change shit after they get backlash. Like, nah, motherfucker. Shit, certain stuff goes certain ways, and you can't just be changing shit when you fuck up. Oh, you, you, people should be able to do whatever. No, there's rules and regulations to everything in life. And if you don't want to follow them, you can fuck off. Pete Ted's interview with Senator Mack will be on tonight at 6. Again, that happened moments ago. Yes. Upstairs. All right, so let's also talk about the race to replace Jim Langevin in Congress. Uh, I'm talking about Jim Langevin. Now let's go watch the apology video now. With member prices, Expedia members, and makers, rideways, and assemblies. I am not going to apologize for being myself and for oh, living a joyful life and for being uh, unapologetically myself in every instance and enjoying a beautiful day off. I am not going to apologize for showing exactly and telling exactly who I am every single step of the way of my campaign. Yeah, I haven't seen the video, but I'm going to go watch that video next with y'all and we're going to see. Because they said she was trying to twerk for votes or some shit like that. We're going to see if she was trying to twerk for votes. We're going to see. Folks who voted for me, they know that T.R. Mack is a silly, authentic, and sometimes bold leader. You can, uh, be, I will not apologize. You can be silly, authentic, but it's a way, it's, it's certain ways you go about certain stuff. If, if you're going to be a president of a high school, nobody wants to see their kids president. I said president. <laughs> If you're going to be the principal of a high school, nobody wants to see the principal twerking. That looks bad. That's unprofessional. I don't give a fuck if it's on your off day. Nobody wants their kid's principal showing young girls to twerk. Maybe if you're a stripper. No, if you are a stripper, that's what you do. Uh, nobody wants to see what What else? Another, another profession. Let's, let's think about it. Any professional, like the president. Okay, if you became president, nobody wants to see the fucking president twerking. Like it's like no, it's not something you want out there. You chose this line of work, so hey, deal with the consequences. Don't try to don't try to uh, make everybody else feel like they crazy because they giving you backlash for doing some weird dumbass shit for being who I am. I will not apologize for fiercely leading my community with a new and fresh voice and mobilizing more people. We don't want you doing all this. White people don't want you twerking being a senator. It looks bad. It just fucking looks bad. It looks bad. It looks fucking bad. 
and up for their rights alongside me. I will not apologize for showing the young queer black woman that they can live a joyful life and still oh, have a positive impact yeah. in their community. And I will not apologize for being able to do a headstand. Um, and I will not apologize for, you know, having enough cake to twerk. <laughs> It is no shock that criticism about me uh, enjoying my free time and using my body to express joy with a small group of friends while on the beach in a bikini that many people wear is coming on the heels of the overturning of Roe v. Wade. Since the twerking video came out, there have been wow. a subset of racist, misogynistic people who have called me anything and everything from uh, the N-word to uh, fat to uh, gorilla, um, many of the negative comments I received have been racially motivated. They have been racially disgusting. They have been comments on my body. But there's black people uh, giving you criticism too. They may not be talking about you, gorilla, but it's black people giving you criticism too. But how are you gonna say racist and misogynistic? I see, I see other other people. I haven't seen the videos, but I seen other people reacting to what you were doing. And it was black. The more matter of fact, the only people I've actually seen say something about this was black people. I was, now there probably are some white people, or you probably are getting some of these comments, but come on now, like don't try to make it seem like it's only white racist people giving you backlash. Um, and none of them have to do with the policy. This has been a very targeted um, attack. On policy of what? You shaking ass? What is the policy? What does anything have to do with the policy? Policy of what? You want to go shake your ass and you get backlash. No, all you have to do with policy and laws and blah, blah, blah. You made it not about that by posting that video. You decided to post that. Did nobody else post that for you? Did nobody else put a gun in your head and say, you better twerk and you better post that shit? Fuck out of here. My person. Um, and again, it is very convenient for the uh, the GOP to try to create oh, a narrative that black the GOP. people and people of color are um, changing I'm saying that. society. There is a status quo, and just because the status quo is changing and the people who lead our country look different doesn't mean that it's bad. It's just different. We need new people who are willing to shake up how we've done things because, quite frankly, how we've done things has it's not worked. Idiot. People are divested. People don't even feel like their vote matters. People don't feel like they have an impact in their community. And I hope that more people see that you can twerk and have fun and you can also make a tangible impact. In yes, you can twerk and have fun. Just don't record it. You know, you just don't record it. You don't have to. You don't have to share everything. This fucking generation fucking... People want to share every fucking thing. That's the problem. You should have shared it. It would have been okay if you would have been doing it with your friends and and y'all kept the video to yourself, like oh laughing, ha ah, ah, ha ah, in your spare time. But you fucking record, you fucking posted it. That's the problem. The problem is you posted the shit. Fuck, man. In your communities, for the better. All right, let's let's go see the actual video. You're watching the Isaiah Factor Uncensored. And welcome back to the Factor Uncensored, the second half. A Rhode Island state senator is getting a lot of attention for an official video. And you you fucking in Rhode Island do it? You a Rhode Island senator? Hey, come on, bro. Like you, you come on, bro. Be aware of where you be aware of what you're doing. The lack of self awareness. You're a fucking Rhode Island senator. Like, um, it's sick. Come on, bro. Stop, stop playing, bro. Stop, stop playing. Bro, Lydon is 79% white, 6.5% black. I rest my case. She's an idiot. She's an idiot. Yo, unofficial video she posted. During her re-election campaign, it's a video of her in a bikini, twerking upside down. To show you, <laughs> of course, the video has gone by. This is really crazy. A lot of conversation. Some people have applauded State Senator Tiara Mack, while others say the video was. Totally I want to see what she said.
She did. She was twerking for votes, bro. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. I don't gotta say no more. Ah oh, man, she this bitch was twerking for votes. That's fucking. That's fucking stupid. That that's that's dumb. That's dumb. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. That's dumb. You're making black people look bad as a whole, bro. When when you do shit like this, when you represent the black people in this capacity, you out here twerking for votes. Lay Cardi B president. Fuck it. Shit. Alright, bro. That's the end of the video. Hit hit that like button. Comment, subscribe. I'm done with this. I'm done with this. No, we're not voting, you idiot ass. Shut up. Look at you. You look stupid. Look at you. You look stupid. You look fucking stupid. I'm out.